the guys in the background? Yeah, sure. Uh, just take me through that the double overtime. Obviously, tensions were high. Um, the game just got a little. It was very chippy. The, the, I thought we were a little sloppy in overtime. To be honest with you, I think we we dominated the regular part of the game and couldn't score. I thought they dominated the overtime, and then we find a way. I mean, it's that's college soccer. Um, you know, I was trying. I made that change with less than a minute left to get Akio on the field for Dylan. And Aku even said to me, he goes, coach, there's only a minute left. And I said, you know, so what? Get it done. Well, he's the one who created that that stuff at the end for Johnny to score. So pretty exciting. Um, what did you see from your team tonight that you think, uh, you know, what were the strong points of your team's performance well, I'll tonight? I'll tell you, the, the, the guy who put on a clinic tonight was Connor Hunsaker. I mean, he showed everybody how to to win the balls in midfield, to win tackles, not pick up yellow cards, and do the job. I mean, for, for me, he was the, uh, the star of the game. But Adrian Perez is a special player, uh, created really something out of nothing on the first goal. And we legitimately had four or five good chances. Their goalkeeper was a star tonight as yeah. well. Uh, had it not been for him and his saves in regulation, this could have been a blowout as well. And then talk about the performance of your defense. Obviously, Felix and Nitty coming up big near the in, in the second overtime. They just they did a good job of covering each other. There was uh, they both made some blunders, but you know they had some heavy legs and they're marking some tough guys. They're not used to marking smaller guys that are that quick. Um, and we're going to talk to them about doing a better job with that next time. But they were solid. So was Jack. So was Aaron. So was Christian. Um, our back line is solid, and and when you put Connor Hunsaker in front of him, it's a it's a tough wall to penetrate. After a double overtime uh, win, your team uh, has another game on Sunday. What what are you stressing at this point? Not to have a like a hangover the next the next time your team comes out. We just we need to step on the field and be ready to to place. I, I don't know what's going on with the San Francisco game. They're probably you know they probably kicked off about an hour ago. Um, but they'll be they'll be tired as well, and they're used to playing on turf. Mm -hmm. So this is a kind of a different element for them. They're not very comfortable playing on this. So we just need to put it to them right from the start, and finish this first round in first place at four one and one. Any final thoughts from from tonight? I told the guys we went on Sullivan, and we we waited till pretty close to the last minute, but we got the win on Sullivan. So I'm pretty excited. Thanks, coach. Thanks.